Sparkling your heart like a satellite, I know There's ghosts in the road in my home, that's right Where creeks and the floors and the water pipes run Hi guys and welcome to my channel. My name is Brittany, just in case you are new, which you probably are because this is a new channel. And if you're not and you are one of my first 30 subscribers, thanks! I cannot believe you guys are here. I already love you so much for just like actually wanting to watch my videos. If you're new, I would love for you to subscribe. Leave me a comment down below, say hey. Come and talk to me, come say hi. I am here today to share my evening routine, specifically my fall evening routine with you all here on YouTube. I already started filming, so I'm kind of in the middle of it right now, but I just wanted to take a few minutes and say hello, put a little intro to the video, and also just say thanks for watching and that I hope you enjoy it. Close my eyes, smother rain rolling cracked About four or five o'clock each day, I try to change out of whatever I'm wearing, unless I'm wearing sweats, then just to keep it real, yes, I will go walking in what I have on. But today I had ran some errands, so I went upstairs and changed really quickly into some workout clothes and then just headed out for a walk. We have a park in our neighborhood, so it's a really great place to just get a nice, casual walk in the evening it takes me about 30 minutes and on the way in I usually grab the mail so that's what you see me doing here I grabbed the mail as I came back down the driveway Circling your heart like a satellite, I know. After I give my two little boys some much needed puppy attention, of course, I go in the kitchen and get a little bit of something to drink. I don't always drink sparkling water after my workout, but I was just craving it today for some reason. And then I went ahead and turned on the television to Buffy because that's been what I've been watching lately. Now I'm just heading upstairs to change out of my sweatshirt and put on a more comfy shirt because I have some blog work to do. I think I actually had a Zoom meeting this evening for one of like the blog groups I'm in. So that's what I did. After I finished getting done what I needed to get done on the computer, I went ahead and started cleaning up the kitchen a bit. I usually unload the dishwasher in the mornings and then load it in the evenings. That's just kind of my system, my little routine. But for some reason today, I had not done it. So I went ahead and unloaded it because I did have some dishes in the sink to do. So I'm just unloading it really quickly and then I'm gonna reload it with the dirty dishes. I don't know what happened to the picture in this little shot, so I just wanted to apologize. The sun started going down, and this is my first time filming in the evening. So I'm sorry in advance if some of the clips are a little bit blurry or the lighting is not that great. I will definitely work on it for the next video. So please give me a little bit of grace. I am sorry about that. So I just finished cleaning up the kitchen, which is something I typically do after I eat dinner, but I ate a late lunch today. I ate around three, so I wasn't really hungry around my normal dinner time. I'm finally getting to where I'm ready to eat a little something for dinner. It is, I think it's like 7.30. I don't have my glasses on, so I can't see the clock in the kitchen. I actually made some chili in the crock pot a couple of nights ago, and I have some of that left over, so I'm gonna eat a little bit of that. It is a vegan chili recipe, and it is really, really delicious. show you my 
my chili really quickly. Every time I make it this way, I just think it tastes so good. I actually put vegan chicken strips and vegan meatless crumbles in there. And I wanted to show you what I get. I get the Morningstar chorizo crumbles and I add those to my chili and I also add these veggie chicken strips by Morningstar. Will you take my heart? Can you promise me? Who else watching this video is a Buffy fan? Let me know. I actually watch Buffy again and again every year. I usually start it at the end of September and watch it during October. It is just a little tradition I have. So let me know in the comments below if you are a Buffy fan too. Once I'm finished with dinner, I put away my bowl and now I'm just gonna go turn on the front porch lights and actually turn off all the lights downstairs, grab my computer and head up to my bedroom for a shower and my evening skincare routine. I can't pass by my little puppies without giving them a little bit of love. I am just removing my makeup really quickly before I get in the shower with a little face wipe. I do cleanse later, but I like to just get that one layer of makeup all off before I actually hop in the shower. Once I am out of the shower, it is time to moisturize. I am using my current favorite body moisturizer, which is the Hemp's Age Defying. I have really been loving this one, especially during the cooler weather months. It is time for my evening skincare routine. I usually cleanse my face in the shower, but since I was filming this, I decided to go ahead and do it at the sink so I could show you my whole skincare routine for the evening. I'm just using a cleanser first. It is the Mario Badescu Acne Facial Cleanser. This is the one I use all the time if I'm not exfoliating my skin. Give it to the page I will not Next, I use a toner. I'm actually using the Rodin and Fields Unblemished Clarifying Toner just because I do have acne prone skin. And now I am going to go ahead and moisturize. At night, I like to use the Anti Wrinkle Deep Wrinkle Night Moisturizer by Neutrogena. I believe it has a little bit of retinol in it, but not too much to irritate my skin. And then I go in with the Sunday Riley UFO oil it's great for spot treatment if you are acne prone like me <laughs> get down to you. and i cannot forget the lip mask i love the lanai lip sleeping mask it is my favorite i use it every night Once I am back in the bedroom, I just unmake the bed and then I'm gonna get in the bed and do a little bit of reading. I try to read every single night. It's something that's important to me. I feel like it really helps me relax before bed and kind of quiet my mind. I actually have two books that I'm reading right now, so I alternate between the two. I read a little bit out of one and a little bit out of the other. I'm currently reading The One Thing by Gary Keller and Jay Papasan, and I am also reading She Means Business by Carrie Green. I've actually read this book before, and it's just a great motivator, especially if you run your own business. I highly recommend it. I will leave both of the books linked below. Every single I'm done reading, it is time to go to sleep. So I'm gonna turn off the lights and blow out my candle. I just wanna say thank you so much for spending this evening with me, and I hope to see you back on my channel soon. Good night. Someone running round in your head tonight Circling your heart like a satellite, I know There's ghosts in